hey, it has been a minute. If you consider three years a minute. Um, yeah, so uh, before I get to what it, what it is I really want to talk to you about, uh, let me give you the quick one minute update on what's been happening. The van that I had is no longer. I am in a school bus now. I have been for almost three years. You can tell the surroundings are a bit different and I'll have to give you a tour here in another video. Uh, let's see, uh, Chaz and Lucky. Unfortunately, uh, Lucky passed away about two years ago. Um, I'm not gonna talk too much about it because I still get kind of, uh, what, what, what's the word, verklempt, yeah? Uh, Chaz has been doing pretty well. Um, unfortunately, he injured his two back legs in two separate incidents over the summer. And uh, as a result, he's lost his lateral stability. So he can still walk and stuff going forward, but he can't jump on the rocks like he used to. I've got to carry him in and out of the bus and stuff. But otherwise, he's, he's, he's happy and healthy outside of that. So the purpose of this video is, well, to reintroduce myself because it's been a while. And then also to talk to you about a, a project that I've been working on and, and, and see if maybe some of you are interested in the project. And if so, any support that you can provide, not money, just participation, you know, like click support, that kind of stuff. Um, but the project name is called My Nomad Directory. And I've spent about uh, uh, close to two years on the project overall right now. And it does three things. First of all, it's sort of like a campsite directory, like many of the other campsite directories that, that you use. I've curated 10,500 campsites in the western U.S., primarily on, on free public lands, but it's got some cheap campsites there too. One of the things that makes it unique is, is that if, if we have a campsite in the database that the other directories have, we'll link to the other sites. So if you're looking at a campsite on mynomaddirectory.com, and it also exists on iOverlander free campsites, Campendium, it'll link you to their reviews. So it makes it a great place to start out. But that wasn't really the purpose of building it. What I wanted to do was to have a place for people to, uh, for nomads to list their services to promote nomad to nomad commerce. And, and, and that's the general idea. So it's got a classified system that's, that's meant to, that's engineered for nomads so that you can place as many ads as you want. It's all free, by the way, all of this stuff is free. But you place your ads, whether it's virtual free pile, if you have a service that you offer, whether that's uh, you know, mobile mechanics, solar installer, seamstress, dog groomer, whatever. But what it does is, as in the system, is you designate a general area so that if you're looking for a campsite, you also get to see the events around that campsite as well as any nomad activity in the classified. So if there's a free item, you'll see it when you're looking at a campsite and it makes it uh, sort of provides the additional context. And I think it also helps us bring each other together in a way that we haven't seen before. So if this My Nomad Directory thing sounds like something that might benefit you or somebody else, if you can share this video, that would be uh, very much appreciated. I also have a presence, or MyNomadDirectory.com has a presence on uh, TikTok, YouTube, and Facebook. Um, I've been running daily videos now for about a week, and that'll continue for, well, for the foreseeable future. So I think we've got enough queued up right now to last until about Christmas time. So it's, it's great seeing you again and uh, please comment i'd love to hear from you if you have any questions about any of this and you want to reach out to me um, you can always message me on uh, on the platform but you can go to my nomad directory just go to the contact form and i'm happy to give you my email address if you'd like to chat about the project or if you have any questions or if you need any support at all i'm, I'm happy to help it's just me and Chaz running the site so you're going to get one of us and uh, because he doesn't have thumbs probably going to be me Anyway, that's it. Um, we'll see you later.